మా కంపెనీ ఐ వాస్ ట్వంటీ ట్వంటీ ఫోర్ బ్యాచ్ కుల్ సో సాధ్వి కమింగ్ టు ఇట్స్ హైరింగ్ ప్రొసీజర్ యూనో వెన్ కంపేర్ టు ది లాస్ట్ ఇయర్ so what is the difference to this 2023 hiring procedure so is it any different or is it the same pattern is same or is it a bit different how is it it is same but due to recession uh, some of the uh, hiring process is slow okay the pattern is same but the procedure is slow pattern is yeah okay so since you got selected into mu sigma as a data analyst uh, profile So, how was your experience, Asad? You know, uh, how many rounds were there? Like, what are the questions they asked to you? How was the assessment pattern? Give a complete uh, talk to our audience. Over to you. No. There are uh, three rounds. First round is exam itself. We wrote exam. Uh, in that exam, they will ask about verbal aptitude and logical reasoning. Okay. And after they will speak at some of the students based on the results. Mm-hmm. And after, no discussion is there. Mm-hmm. in that gd also for uh, they will again separate some groups in group discussion each group consists of seven or eight members so they will just give a uh, task like gd uh, they just ask do some don't about a question they will not ask the same question to all for each group they will ask different questions as per our group they ask you about will the company should trust you that you will be in the company for more years or only some months they ask the both that and they ask do's or don'ts you know to say in that i said nothing the trust is nothing but we do, it doesn't mean we need to stay in the same company for long years if you learn if you gain the knowledge whatever you want in that company it's enough of being there so again to gain the knowledge it's your wish to be in the company or you need to change sure. and those things we said and that whole group they select one or two members as per their wish and they will not they will just see the speaking skills how, what you what you said and how you said and how fluent you are speaking and those things mm-hmm. and after gd also last peer personal interview is there every round is a elimination process they will not hide all of them from there okay. uh-huh. so in every round they will remove some of the members whoever they like they will take mm-hmm. and the last one personal interview is nothing but nothing coding is there in music bob room main point and also in us uh, in that they just ask the board what is the projects you did what are the internship you did what you gain from the internship or not the project mm-hmm. and what are the they, they just ask what is the languages you just know and what are the languages you used for the project work and what you did in your project and what you gain from your internship also they ask mm-hmm. and also you are um, um, what do you think about my sigma company mm-hmm. do you like my company or you are just coming as for as coming to all companies mm-hmm. okay and yeah and also they gave a small scenario also in that they'll just ask they will just see how you think about uh, coming managing skills and those things in that scenario and also they ask our place points i mean your positiveness your negativeness what do you think about a person if someone is not doing any work what will you do in that situation will you support her to do the work or directly will you complain to your management and those things they will just see yeah finally they will just see like um is there if they give a chance for you will you learn or will you be blindly going on currently we got a overview about uh, the whole uh, my sigma hiring procedure right so we'll put a spotlight by one by one okay so first you mentioned it was a assessment so how was the assessment uh, round sadhvi like what was your experience like what are the questions what are the sections you got in the assessment round any talk on that it's tough everything is the basic point only okay. about the lot um there is no, not much time we should balance the timing also okay. for every question uh, just give 30 seconds or 50 seconds no nothing is chat or chatty So Sadhvi what was the platform uh, they used in it talk on that yeah come on they kept they even kept a mail for us got a mail who got selected from the first round and they got the mail and password and the email id that mm-hmm. number we got login okay so what was the platform uh, the name of a platform do you remember sarthaka yeah for all you need to submit okay sarthaka cool so camera was on correct Yeah, for whole three rounds, it's uh, camera is on itself. All right. 
So next you mentioned it was a group discussion. Yeah. What was your group discussion experience? Any talk on that? Yeah, firstly we got feared of entering one mom is there and the eight to nine members is there. Everyone looks like they are well prepared for the group discussion. But we didn't, uh, we went, so Devian who yeah, just answered, um, we should not be silent while they are asking questions. We should come in front and we should say, ma'am, can I say, can I say. And also, uh, they will see our face expressions, how we are giving. We should not keep any angrily or things. If someone is saying, we should be smiling. And also, we should not shout on anyone, like, and let me say, wait for a time, we should not say like that. If the chance comes, we need to say. And also, at last, they ask the conclusion. What is the conclusion you are giving? Hmm. And we should get a friend step and we need to say, Ma'am, can I say the conclusion like that? They will just see the interaction, how we are interacting with the other persons and how we are behaving with the others. Cool. So, what was the topic uh, given, Sadhvi? Do you remember? What was the topic for the GD? Some of the topics are, um, if A comes to real world, Will the jobs decrease or increases? Do's or don'ts for the A reality. And also another topic is for, for our friends, another topic is online classes. Is it helpful or not helpful? Okay. Also trust, um, they can a company trust you or not? Do's and don'ts. Okay. Yeah, every question gets done two steps itself. Do's and don'ts. Okay. So this was all about uh, the group discussion. So, how was the group discussion, uh, Sadhvi? Like, how many members were there in one discussion? Any idea? Okay, uh, since it was on campus hiring, uh, like, how did they bisect the batches? Like, uh, seven people in a single, single batches, or it's like whole uh, batch in a single discussion? Like, how was it actually? Yeah, it's not batch, not. All the students, they separated. Seven members per a batch. Okay. And I got from timing as 3 to 3.15. Okay. And 3 to another batch will start. Okay. So in a single batch? Or mail itself. Okay. So in a single batch, it was a mixture of all the departments. Correct? Yeah. Sure. All right. So this was all about uh, GD. So next round was? So next was person. Uh, how was your experience? It is my first interview itself. So, when I log in, ma'am said to say about oh, what's your name and introduce yourself. And again, she asked, um, oh, what are the coding, you know, just she asked nothing much about that. And what is your experience? Is there any before experience of internships or anything? I said my experience of internship, what I did and what I learned from there. And also she asked, did, are you doing any project work? I said, yeah, I'm doing this project of so on. So I said about that and what, what I learned from that. So on things I said. And she asked, so asked, what do you think about New Sigma company? And also a scenario based question she asked. And uh, to know about our positivity, how we are thinking or what, what we will do. And also she said, if you are see, uh, teaching something, will you learn or will you say, I already know I will get into the same thing. Okay. Like this small question they ask it. And also, uh, what is your achievement thing, what you are achieved in your life? Yeah, they also said that when you enter into the company, how should you be there? Or you should not show any attitude with your seniors or your uh, juniors, how we are coming with you. And they said to be friendly with all. No one is, um, no one is show, uh, showing any partiality or anything. Everyone will be same with you all. Be friendly and do work combinedly. So, so this was all about uh, the personal interview. No uh, DBMS kind of questions, no technical questions, nothing. For me, they didn't ask some of the interviewers. They may ask. For me, they didn't ask. So, all right. So, uh, we'll put a focus on uh, the platforms, uh, Sadhvi. Like, what are the platform you referred while you know preparing for this company? So, what was the platform you used? Any idea on that? First, first, first round itself about the, that exam itself. We went off um, Indian bit. That platform we learned some of the basic things. India. Yeah. 
aptitude was well and logical reasoning we learned from that one mm-hmm. and also we referred some of the uh, um, videos and those things how to prepare for interviews and those things so all right cool and uh, this was all about uh, the mu sigma hearing procedure correct so next we'll put a spotlight on its uh, job description so what was the eligibility criteria sadvi to sit for the drive ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪೆಕ್ಟೆಡ್ they yeah, at first only they said uh, the uh, salary itself about 5 lakhs it will start mm-hmm. and every year they will increase 1.5 1.5 um, overall 4 years 30 lakhs this okay it's like a 4 year okay 4 in 4 year bond and uh, you will be having 30 lakh by the end of the 4 year yeah there so, any talk on yeah that's what if you want to if you work there for one year and again if you want to drop out there is no chance if you want to drop out you should pay the money return back one to two years in between you should pay nearly 10 lakhs i think yeah two to four years you should pay eight and off or seven and off something you should not break the bond once you have joined chalo all right so any talk on uh, the training and internship uh, sadhvi I uh, didn't have any internship at, at all, but they just said um, at starting uh, July or August they will call and they will give one to two days preparation. Okay. So, all right. Based on the training, they will conduct an exam. And based on the marks, they will, if you got at first exam only, if you passed the exam directly, they will shift into some um, projects directly. Otherwise, if you are failed, they will teach you again until you pass the exam. That's what the place point. They will not remove you directly. They will give you chances for you until you learn. Okay. Uh, how many numbers of attempt uh, they will provide? Any idea on that? No idea about that. I, I do ask our seniors that they are still learning itself. Still learning. Okay. Cool. Sorry. Uh, I guess we covered everything. Uh, any suggestion to our audience, uh, Sadhvi? Yeah, some of them are saying four years bond, it is too high. We can't stay four years in the same company. Just my suggestion is of, within two years, you are not stopping your job and you are going somewhere. Every, anyways, you are doing job. So it is not the wrong path to choose the new sigma. It is the right path. They will, you, they will just let you learn the things. They will not directly assign you works and they will not directly pressure you something. they will just teach you and they will let you learn the things basic thing so i think we seek my is the best thing to learn to find your path cool. so sadvi last question uh, what is the plus point of uh, mu sigma company any idea on that for well, some remaining companies and mu sigma what is the difference means for remaining companies at starting only they will say yeah we are hiring you and they will give you 6 months internship after internship they will keep a exam and if you passed in that exam only they will take mm-hmm. uh, uh, if you got a less mark even one mark they will not take you they will just remove you there mm-hmm. in that if you keep up also already 6 months completed even college is not giving any placement so that is the main backlog for remaining companies and as per to the music mom they are just teaching you they are not directly throwing you or keeping exam on those things they are teaching you and they will keep as they will keep exam and if you get less marks also they will give another chance to you to reach your goal okay so this is the plus point of uh, you know joining me sigma correct 